your water, even in the soothing cascade of my shower. A faint melody graces my ears. The vastness of the ocean both frightens and enthralls me, pulling me towards it. I mustered the courage to reach out to a woman named Amelia, though she initially hesitated to talk with me. However, when I shared a few details about Rhea and his journal, she agreed to meet with me, though our visit is still weeks away. I recently came across a passage in a book about the power of connections and how they strengthen spells. I'm struggling to comprehend its message. And that's why I need your help. In Ray's room, I discovered a collection of CDs. I'm scared to go through them, but I'll look at them soon. A few of you responded to my post, filling me with hope. It feels like something crucial is missing from my life. A memory of my parents. A memory of their faces. I can't even recall their features. They tragically passed away in a car accident. An event etched vividly in my memory. I can still remember the blood, the sight of my father's headless body. But the rest remains fragmented. I know I was in elementary school at the time, but I can't remember my age. After the accident, I went to live with my uncle, who became like a father to me. My best friend. He was compassionate and only saw the good in people. Despite our support, I never quite belonged. I did a lot of stupid things to fit in. I'm hoping that I'll be able to feel like myself again and move on with my life.